Once you complete your free sign up for Magic School AI, open up the app and your window will look like this. At the top left of your screen, you'll see a search bar. This is the place where you want to go if you want to quickly search a tool by name. Let's say I have a reading lesson and I want to generate a decodable text for that lesson. All I need to do is start typing the name of the tool and the tool will quickly move to the top of the page. Once you click on the tool and you've created your decodable text, you can quickly move back to the full list of tools by clicking the back button. The next thing I'd like to show you is how to access a group of tools by clicking on the category buttons that you see across the top of your screen. Each of these buttons provides a quick way to access a certain category of tools. For instance, if you need a tool that might help you with a certain aspect of your planning, but you aren't sure which tool to use, click on the planning button and that will bring all of the tools that are focused on planning lessons to the top of your screen. If you'd like to quickly make a question set for a particular topic, clicking on the questions button will allow you to see the tools that might help you with that. When you want to see all of your tools again, you can simply click the all button and the complete list of tools will reappear. You can also personalize your Magic School display by adding the tools that you use most often to your favorites. To mark a tool to your favorite, simply click the star at the top right hand corner of the tool you'd like to add. Let's say I'd like to add the choice board generator to my favorites. I'll scroll down to find the choice board generator. And click the star at the top right hand part of the tile. You'll notice that the tool is no longer in your screen. That's because it's been moved to the top left hand corner of your screen. Each tool that you add to your favorites will move up to the top of the screen and be listed directly before the tool that you last added to your favorites. If I add the lesson plan generator, you'll see that it's listed right before the choice board generator. These favorites will be saved and will remain at the top of your screen so that each time you log into Magic School, you'll have easy access to them. I hope you've enjoyed this quick tour of the Magic School app. In the next section, we'll look at how to use one of the most popular tools, our rubric generator.